name is Neil Stressler and I do my research on optimal tool control, so the way how we control our tightening tools, trying to find better ways to optimize it and uh, use the state of the art and control theory to do that better. I have worked a couple of years for Atlas Copco already, so I worked as uh, a mechanical engineer here before I started my PhD. The tools we do in general, what we do, is our business is the tightening and tightening of bolts and the threaded fasteners. Once I started, I really discovered how much knowledge there is required to do this in a, in a very good way. And this I really found as a, as a challenge and this is something which, which I get really triggered by and really want to put a lot in effort. My research is really on our tools, so it mainly targets to, to make our tools better. But I mean, in the long run, our tools help their, our customers to, to have their production line running more robust, more efficient or quicker, get, getting shorter tech times, which is very important in the automotive or the aerospace industry to get their tech times down so they can produce their products quicker or yeah, in a more controlled way. And my research somehow contributes to customers to do exactly this. If we really manage to implement what I'm researching on, we will get a lot of very happy customers. My research, uh, as, as I mentioned, uh, works on optimizing our tightenings, and this can be from many perspectives. It can be like in, in the accuracy of how we tighten threaded fasteners. Uh, one side effect there, if you know you do this more accurate, uh, it helps the, the customers to choose smaller bolts and uh, thread fasteners and joints. And by, by this, uh, it gets lighter, so they have this uh, savings in weight. And this, if it's a product which is driven by fuel, saves fuel in the long run. There is usually, there are times where I just sit at home, it's usually very late or in the middle of the night, and I, I can't really sleep because I have a problem that just uh, kind of keeps bouncing around in my head and I would say the best ideas I get in the middle of the night uh, and then I really always have my notebook with me trying to take notes so I at least get some sleep that night and now this idea will be saved for the next day and then I can come to work and uh, really wrap my head around it and my thoughts. Mm -hmm.